Doreen is now 21. She started at the Kabubu Primary School when she was 11 and when she was living with her uncle's family. Well, when I first heard, I heard the sponsor to go to Kabubu Primary School. I was really, really happy. I was young, I had lost my father and I had no fees and my uncle had no fees for me because he had so many kids to take care of. Doreen finished primary education and graduated to secondary school. In 2006 she won a scholarship to Bede Senior School near Hailsham in East Sussex. When I arrived in the UK I was surprised to learn the way they do things, certain things like the ways of teaching is quite different from Ugandan way of teaching because they do mostly um, practicals whereas here we do so much of theory which is really too hard. The way they um, welcome people, it was really awesome to me. The thing I most struggled with in the UK was was the fact that they didn't okay I'm not saying all of them but so many people I used to be with in my school didn't know anything about God because in Uganda I mean not all of them but most of the people believe in God. After starting GCSE in the UK she returned to Uganda to take A-levels. In May 2013 she will complete a diploma course in hotel management and catering. But when I was in my A-level I did foods and nutrition and I got so much interested in hotel, cooking and hospitality so that's why I chose to be so much. I wonder how to get married <laughs> and have children but I want to have three and I want I want a man of my tribe really <laughs> and another thing is I want to get married after having done something of my own because so many married people get problems, I mean women. Reports worldwide indicate that a girl who completes education makes a choice to later limit the size of her family.